Holly Parton, Lily Tomlin, and Jane Fonda lit up the big screen in the movie 9 to 5. And now the Broadway musical version of the film hits the stage at Parker High School in Janesville. Michael Bruno goes backstage to find out how these high schoolers deal with a rather mature musical. Now, I know you have a big challenge. You're doing this show to tracks rather than a live orchestra. Yes. What's the big challenge with that? Well, um, it is certainly you don't have the give and take that you might, but what we find are really positives with this is that students can rehearse and get used to those sounds from the very beginning and uh, really time things out. So, so we think it still is a real positive experience for, the, uh, for our students. I had seen the Broadway musical. I had seen some clips from the movie, but I hadn't seen the full movie at the time of auditions. Have you seen it since you've been in the I show? Have. I and have. And do you find some little similarities between you and Lily? I hope that I do. <laughs> I mean, I like to think that I'm a very strong person, independent, very willing to think for herself and wants better for herself. Move ahead, but the boss won't seem to let me. I swear sometimes that man is out to get me. So every musical has to have a villain, and I guess that has to be you. I guess Playing so. the rotten, mean, awful boss, Franklin Hart. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so was this tight casting for you? Um, no, not at all. <laughs> I, I, I sure hope not. By the way, is that the present for my wife? Yes, it is, sir. But I would like to remind you that it says nothing in my job description about... Damn it, Violet! I'm trying to explain to Jody here. Jody? How are all a team and right away you're not there for the handoff? A lot of people that are up on that stage that are doing everything that you would in the 1970s didn't fully understand it yet and so i feel like we can portray this message about how far we've come to everyone You're a freshman and you landed a lead role. Yeah. You must be awfully proud of it. That's a great accomplishment. Yeah. I'm sure all the seniors are horribly jealous of you. Maybe. <laughs> so do you really enjoy singing like your favorite thing you do? Mm-hmm. Yeah, my favorite song that I sing is Get Out and Stay Out. That's near the end of the show. And that's your big that's your big curtain. Yeah, that's my big it? number. <laughs> Follow me. Well, hey, who's this here? Judy Burnley, first day. Hey, Judy, I hope everyone's been treating you real friendly and showing you around. If there's anything I can do for you, just give me a holler, because I know what it's like to be the new girl in town. Kendall, you are the famous, famous, fabulous Dora Lee. Yeah. <laughs> How great is that? It's really fun. It's awesome. I love it. And was it intimidating knowing you were playing the famous Dolly Parton in the show? Very. <laughs> I was very afraid I wasn't going to be able to pull it off. An incremental, uh, oops. Oh, I'll get it. You sure you don't need a little help down there? Oh, no, sir, I'm fine. So I understand one of the difficulties that you have is you have a stammer, but when you sing, you have a beautiful voice and the stammer goes away. That's un astounding. Yeah, it's, uh, it's more like, um, it's when I speak, it's like a start and stop thing, but it's when you sing, it's all flowy and it flows better. It's um, more, um, it's musical. So you find it really freeing singing? Oh, absolutely, very. Shit, that don't hurt. Now please don't think I'm just a flirt. It's just I'm nuts about you. Well, that explains why they've all been treating me like some damn store floozy. They all think I'm banging the box. Now, wait a minute. I can explain. And you love it, don't you? And Michael joins us now. I guess there was <laughs> some discussion about the mature themes with the group before they selected this. There was. I, I was. I was kind of surprised that a high school would do something as adult themed as nine to five, but they handled it really well. The kids seemed to like, you know, be very comfortable with it, and now you know they're doing a great job. They're an amazing group of kids. The talent in the. At 
the high school level n never ceases to amaze me. I mean, they are unbelievably talented. Uh, the, I, the same thing. I think these kids are like 13 to 16 years old, and they're wow. doing these unbelievable <laughs> shows. It's really, really, really amazing. What year did the movie come out? Do you remember? It was Mark? in the 70s. I think it came out. I believe it came out in the 70s. Because it, it, it's about in, in the 70s era. Because yeah. they were talking about the costumes were all like polyester. And like, <laughs> I don't want to wear this stuff. <laughs> but the story holds up. That's for sure. And you're never going to get that song out of your mind. No, you're, you're, you're singing nine to five all the time. Grammy Award winning. <laughs> All right. Thank you, Michael. You're, You're welcome. off next week. Have a good Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving. We should oh, tell thanks, folks Michael. 9 to 5 Parker High School, Janesville tonight, and tomorrow night at 7.30 Sunday at 2 p.m. Tickets available at the box office. Or 7 It is at 7 o'clock, not 7.30. And if you have a show you want Bruno to know about, let us know for Backstage with Bruno.